everyone if you remember last time we used the bird scooter to we had this last time we uh, took apart and we harvest the cells now this is another example of the cells that we have so today I'm gonna make a power bank a power bank like this it has a USB port, micro USB port charging. This power bank uh, sell on Amazon around $25, $30 based on the how many milliamp. These are 2500 milliamp or 2.5 amp as you can see. So these ones are, uh, you put them eight together and based on that you can find out how many amp power total you get so we have 8 times 2.5 you get 20,000 milliamp or 20 amp hour for 8 of them so now we're going to make a power bank like this in order to do so we need a gun we need a soldering and I'm using the spot welded you can use it in soldering also First, what we're going to do, we're going to have these negative side and positive side on top. Put it all near each other like that. I can use it alignment. I'm using the heat gun. It's on. So make sure the positive on one side and negative in one side. Now put them here. If you put positive in one side and negative one side, it become parallel. If you have a positive one side and put in the negative in this side, it become series. So this way the voltage become double. But when you have parallel, your voltage is going to be same. Your amp going to increase. Your amp hour going to increase. spot building to parallel this together just do the little bit clean up okay a little bit larger cut it Spot building. Okay. I'm going to do the alignment. Okay. Now I'm going to do the other side.
missed this part because of the there's like a bump under yeah that should be fine there we go so now this is going to be balanced we already tested this it was 3.7 each so now I'm gonna use the my welding and I have this power bank here. This power bank kit you can buy it off Amazon, maybe on eBay or AliExpress around 10, 5 to 10 dollars. Sometimes you can buy them with less. But this one is 8x, so it comes with the display, BMS, USB ports. What we're going to do? We're going to put them all together. Push it. All the way goes down to the pin. Now we have a positive and negative. We're going to make sure that the positive and the negative matches. Right there, fit right there. So, extra piece here. Take it apart. So now I'm going to solder here. Also, this side. Okay. Now I'm going to use the block for the negative. So, this way. Now I have to. It's going to only draw maybe one amp, maximum uh, two amp. So we don't need a heavy gauge wire. It's done. USB. Let's try it. I'm gonna see if I can charge my phone. Alright. Plug it here. And I have my phone here. There we go. Charging. Just on the other one. Okay. Charged. Okay guys, this is the end of it. 
power pack is ready you can use a micro usb port for charging the actual power pack you can carry it to anywhere you like especially kids love it they use this as cool ready guys thank you